Real quickly before we begin, I want to thank this video's sponsor, CarMarshall.com. CarMarshall.com can save you lots of money on buying used or new vehicles, cars, trucks, school buses. If you want to save money, I'll have a link in the description down below. I know I'm going to... My name is Erickson Harrell, and about uh, on November 22nd, I was arrested for uh, exercising my First Amendment right. Um, it's been almost two, three weeks now, and just recently found out the case has been dropped due to uh, lack of evidence, a lack of validity to the claim. So yeah, we now we move forward. The, the resistance doesn't stop. She got an email last night where she told me that the case has been dropped, and from that moment on, Everyone, all my coworkers started texting me saying, yeah, yeah, the case has been dropped. Congratulations. Good job. I definitely think this is a victory for the liberty, the freedom movement all around the world. Um, I think it touched uh, a personal uh, connection with everyone because they needed to see a, a police officer or a soldier, someone out there defending their right as a citizen. So it definitely is a victory. And I, I would hope that it touched another officer or another military to stand, stand up now and, uh, you know, protect the weak and the, the sick and the elderly because uh, when the time comes they're going to need our guidance, they're going to need our, our training and our, our, our dedication. I definitely want to address the, the police, the military, um, the everyday patriot out there, that Al-Qaeda isn't the one taxing us into poverty, Al-Qaeda isn't the one attacking our Second Amendment, Al-Qaeda isn't the one uh, attacking the Fourth Amendment and stripping us of our rights. Our foe looks like us, they dress like us, and uh, we see them every day on television telling us that um, they need to take more of our civil, li civil liberties. I definitely believe the, um, when it went viral and they saw the, uh, the a attention, that they, made, they questioned the, uh, the arrest. Uh, <laughs> um, definitely, I believe all the, uh, the phone calls and people calling my agency and probably the, um, uh, the police station over at the plantation definitely helped. The state attorney uh, reviewed the case and they determined that I had not broken any laws and my actions on that day were legal and lawful. The, the law is simple. Um, you can be in a public domain, uh, even a private property, if you're given authorization. You can wear a mask. Uh, if you're not committing a crime, you're, you're allowed to uh, wear a mask. And um, the, the, the law is simple. You know, It's been in place since the 1980s, and um, you know, people should get out there and exercise their rights. We don't exercise them, we're, um, we're going to lose them. So. Peer pressure is a son of a gun because uh, a lot of my co-workers, um, there's, a, there's a handful that support me and uh, the others, uh, a lot of these are big macho guys and uh, they, they are more interested in the football and the, uh, you know, the sons of anarchy, the reality shows. But it's funny though, they'll see something in the news and uh, they'll relate it to something I said and uh, they'll pull me aside and go, hey, what do you think about that? Does that sound like a conspiracy? You know, so it, it does kind of, you know, give me a applause to, to yeah. continue on, to continue to talk. Because when you talk, they can't take back what they hear. Why do you go into that and how do you deal with that pressure? Well, I took the red pill. And uh, <laughs> um, I understand the, the, the psychology behind the brainwashing that we've, um, we've undergone. Um, I understand that they've, um, their military and police officers are deep under this uh, brainwashing. So I, I know it, it takes a little bit more work than the average citizen to, uh, to try to get them to think outside the box. Anything you'd like to say out there to people who might be considering becoming active? Do it. Do it. Because, um, again, in my first interview, you know, we don't have the luxury of um, not being involved. Um, we, we, we risk a greater threat if we don't get involved. And if you truly care about your family, you will, you will get involved. I definitely think it's going to get worse before it gets better. But I think we can create a, um, uh, a resistance to it. You know, the more people that are waking up, the more people that are acting out, we can, uh, we can slow down the, the system. We can create friction in the system. And uh, I think definitely the, the, um, the resistance, uh, the new world order, they think they can kill us all, but they won't be able to kill us all. Uh, they'll, uh, there'll always be a small resistance. Nature and God will find a way and uh, we will prevail. afraid to talk why about your depopulation you plan. Why don't you get lost? Why should I get lost? It's you're serious. Sick person. Sick person. How am I sick? You're the one kind of meeting. Mr. Rothschild, how you doing, sir? Can you tell us what went on at the Bilderberg meeting this year? Sorry? Can you tell us what went on at the Bilderberg meeting this year? 
I didn't go to that actually, no. The Bilderberg? You weren't there? No. Not this year. What went on uh, last year? No, I wasn't. Hey, Sheridan County. This is Sheridan County Cop Watch. And I just wanted you to know that uh, I am using this stuff under fair use. And uh, also, uh, remember to like and subscribe this channel. Uh, also, too, uh, keep in mind I do not make any money on YouTube. Uh, this is uh, five hours work a day, uh, you know, fighting for freedom. And uh, I do, I, you can donate with PayPal and Patreon. Uh, I just want you to think about this. If everybody gives uh, to PayPal and Patreon, Patreon is every month. Actually, PayPal you can do every month. I have 12,000 subscribers. If everybody gives, I can uh, quit my regular job and go full-time investigations on Charlotte County and possibly even more and beyond. So just keep that in mind. If everybody helps out, I can go full-time doing this. Thanks.